Greetings, everyone, and welcome to the Stanley Cup playoffs with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro in just a moment. I'm Mike Emmerich, and here we are at the beginning of it all. Whether you won the division or whether you just barely scraped in, you're here. That's important. What do you say to your team? Well, let's control what we can. Uh, you're right, Doc. Home ice, being the visiting team, doesn't really matter. At the end of the day is that you have to control what you can, how you play, how you compete, and this is what it's all about. It's the best time of year, and we've seen over history teams that have won the conference have gone on to the Stanley Cup. We've seen teams that finished in eighth spot have gone on and won the Stanley Cup. So it really doesn't matter. As long as you give yourself a chance when you get in, anything can happen. Just looking around this building, Doc, you know there's a sense of excitement. It's a long road to get to the Stanley Cup final, but this is where it all begins, and everybody is certainly jacked up for this. And of course, Carey Price starts in goal. In the prime of his career, he's racked up all kinds of credentials. Olympic gold, the NHL all-rookie team, and considered the best goaltender in the world. John Gibson gets the start. Native of Pittsburgh was only 20 when he broke into the NHL in the Stanley Cup playoffs with the Ducks. Like a lot of goalies, good size, 6'3", 210. As we begin, Jonathan Huberdeau is a guy to watch for. Highly skilled, quick, and clever. With Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich, this playoff game has begun. Corralled by Carter. Oh, he staggered it. And the puck taken over by Markov. Gets in. What'll he do? Puck loose. Good defensive play. He is shut right off. Well, we expected a physical game, Doc, and it looks like he's on a mission trying to set the tone for his team. Oh, stick save. Rinkside we go now, and here is Ray Ferraro. Not only are the players excited, you can hear a difference in the building's noise in the playoffs. This place is going off. Okay, Ray, thank you. Solid, clean win. Columbus looking to head man up the wing. Laid on to Kuznetsov. Slid to Oshie. Hanging on to it up the wing. Propelled to Carter. Outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. For a couple of weeks at the Olympics in Sochi, Russia, he was known as TJ Sochi. But that's TJ Oshie who started his National Hockey League career with the St. Louis Blues. He won a championship at the University of North Dakota for college hockey and has become one of the premier shootout players in the entire National Hockey League. And that's how he made his mark and his name at the Olympics through the shootout. Loose puck, not stick handled well there. Right near the line, can he keep it going? Knocked it away with the stick. The Condors starting back in their own end. Snapping a pass to Larkin. Enormous collision. He was looking to knock him into the third row. Many yards gain to Cromwell. Price decided to cover. I don't think the shooter got much on this, but the goaltender makes an excellent stick stop on a relatively easy shot. Quick work on the faceoff. Chooses the corner. Puck loose now picked up. Columbus wanting to generate something. They'll try up the wing. Save. A brilliant save. What quickness side to side. On the Hayes. Shot. What good solid poke check there. Chip to Ponick. It's an onside play. Gathered up again by Jokin. Stays along the boards. Good work there. They'll have to try it again. Got his pad on a changing shot. Cleveland's looking to head man up the wing. Back to the point. Waits from the corner. 
laid on to Weber. A great wrist shot. Looking to Borowicki. Mambas carries it along the side. And at an angle to a left. A shot, save. Look at how active the goaltender is looking around the screen to try to make the stop. Pitching it to Palmieri. He gains the zone. Terrific interception. Got it in his own end. To Payarvi. Wow, he slowed him right down there. The net was knocked off, and so play is stopped. Gibson's blocker save is a pretty routine one. He's in good position, and he deflects this out of danger. Just a hair under four minutes left in the first. Game still waiting for its first goal. Good reach there. Great stick work prevents the pass from being complete. Slid back across from one point to the other. That was a major league collision. The Knights get two for cross-checking. Doc, you could push in the game of hockey, but once you get that stick up, two hands on the stick, that's a penalty. The Condors go on the power play for the very first time. Let's see if they can capitalize. The key to their power play is to support all over the ice. Eddie, I'm with you on that. Power play beginning. And that will help to at least clear the puck away. Gardner's carrying it back in his own end, hoping for neutral ice. Pass cut, strong play. And the heat's taken off by the clear. The Condors continue on in the defensive zone. No completion on that. Marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. That was a great job. Shot back down. More time off the clock. Passing one off now to Markov. Gets in. What will he do? Let's it go. Solid glove save. Routine stop for the goaltender. The shooter's going to have to do a much better job challenging him. Defensive zone win. Good job of clearing. Nearing the final minute of play. Directing that one to Larkin. Possession still as he moves up the wing. Play to be made now by Cromwell. Up to the point. March narrowly inside. Surprised this puck ended up in the back of the net. The defensive team was really low. I think they actually helped screen their own goaltender. Plus, she had the offensive team in front as well. Face off win, and now what will they do with it? Gains the zone and looks over his options. Defense to offense, begun by Curtin. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. 19 minutes, two seconds. Fires. The first frame is done. Now they get a rest. Only one goal scored and two periods yet to go. Join our fan club and receive a membership card. Discounts on team merchandise and team ring zones as well as email notifications on upcoming... The difference in the game is just one goal, and it came late in that period. Will it springboard to something more in the second? We'll see, but for now, we go to break.
We are in the early stages of this game, about to begin the second period. Your thoughts on the first? Cleveland's lucky to still be in this game after the first period. They had turnover after turnover. I'm sure the coaches addressed that problem in the intermission. Loose puck blocked off by Gardner. The puck is free, now taken up by Huberdeau. Nicely into the zone. One-timer. They can't find the target. Gathered in by Carter. And he gains the zone. Skill play by Markov. Moving it now up the wing. Oh, and he is drilled. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. Slid. Score! And the game is even. Oh, she's able to clear open ice, and he lays a sweet saucer pass on the shooter's stick. Knights have even the game here. Still in the second period, anybody's game now. Cleveland's got that neutral zone faceoff. Puck is thrown to Markov. Takes that pass and looks on. Now it's directed to Markov. Gains the blue line. One into another. Weber's skill is known throughout the league, but when he throws his body around, everybody takes notice. Save! Good, solid defensive play with the stick. One-timer, outstanding offense met by solid goaltending. Price makes the save, not even breaking a sweat. He's in good position, that allows him to make this stop. Good job on the draw. The Condors hopefully shifting from defense to offense in their own end. Gains the zone. Propelled to Ponick. On to Seidenberg. The Knights wheel one ahead up the wing. Puts one on. Save! Shot. Hung right over him and couldn't get it past. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. I don't know if he's going to make a save much easier than that one. He's in good position. It's a rather routine stop. Good help for the center. Moving it to Jokinen. Out in front. Big save with a glove. I think it changed direction there. Win the draw. Chip got a piece of it with the glove. And angled to Borowicki. Trying to go to Boschman. Blocked away. One timer. Tipped away. Looking for room. Centering. Tips it back. Snaps it to stall. Faces up to the point. Back to the point. Sends it across the blue line. Good quick stick. Nicely into the zone. Shot, a wonderful shot answered quickly. You don't get many better opportunities than that. Great save. Terrific stop, and it's loose. Covered up just to slow things down. Routine stop for the goaltender. The shooter's gonna have to do a much better job challenging him. Just under seven minutes remaining in the second. We are at one goal apiece. Good clean win on the draw. Gives it to the point. Shoots it off. 
Ring 10 bells for that save. The Condors with a clean win on the draw. Good use of the stick, broke that pass up. And gathered in by Shea Weber. Pass attempt to Carter. Looking for options up the wing. That one is pointed to him. Outstanding save, difficult opportunity. Snapped out of the air. Price is going to stop that puck all night long. It's not a difficult shot, but it's his positioning that makes it look so easy. Good job on that faceoff, tying the man up. A good stick there, so no complete pass. Up the wing, making some headway. Into the attacking end. Laid on to Tulusti. Oh, great cut. Pitching this one to Jenner. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Columbus in their own end, continuing on. Slid to Domi. No! Sometimes you can be too cute. You're in the middle of the ice. You want to make a perfect shot. He misses the net. Last minute of play. Into the last minute of the second period. Score! Two straight goals. The goal scorer put that puck in a shooting position, let it go, and beat the goaltender clean. Sometimes your best isn't enough. This is a perfect shot up over a desperation attempted glove save. The Knights have gotten a lead that they hope to take into the third, as long as they don't go into a shell. And they've won the faceoff. Oh, did he ever get matched? There's a phrase in hockey, hit or be hit. That's exactly what happened. Manson's skating ability gets him into position here to deliver a crushing hit. Good face-off win. One-timer. Puck covered, whistle blown. The Knights get the draw. That's a good solid hit, he'll feel that one. He's got it on his stick, he wants to clear it out of the zone. Two periods have been played. They've worked pretty hard at it, and they get a well-deserved rest. Third period coming up shortly. Fans, take a look at our scoreboard as we acknowledge tonight's special groups in attendance. Jenner's late period tally has made all the difference and will cause both coaches to say something. Intermission is here. Forty minutes down, at least twenty minutes to go. What are your thoughts so far? The Knights have been the better team, Doc, through two periods of play. They're up by one as we get ready to start the third, but it could be more with the chances that they've had through the first forty minutes. We have begun the third period. Feeds the point. Propelled to Weber. On to Palmieri. Chip to Spurgeon. Wonderful block. Laid on to Palmieri. And that one went offside. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. Directed on. That shot came from nowhere. Oh, big rebound here. Good stick work, and for that reason, it's a chance for the offense. Drives it. Missed the net. 
This is a momentum building shift. Kicks it to Carter. Gently on back to Weber. Back again to Weber. Hands over to Oshi. Pass across at the point. The shot blocked. Snapping a pass to Markov. Looking to Huberdo. Loose puck gathered by Spurgeon. Into the end of attack. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Slid to Cromwell. Propelled to Spurgeon. Nice tip of the pass. Great pressure. And on to Henrique. Down low again. Can he clear? Pitching it to Huberdo. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Around through the corner right now. Ran into the defense. He's lost it. Columbus, in their own end, has possession. Passing one off now to Tulusti. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. Let's it go. Score! That's his first playoff goal. Tulusti's quick hands allowed him to snap that one off and score the goal. The passer recognizes that he's got to get the puck up in the air, but he displays sweet hands as it goes just over the stick and lands flat on the ice. Columbus has gotten this game back even here in the third period. A fun way to go down the home stretch of the contest. They won the faceoff. Games the zone. He chipped that one off the boards and ahead. Oh, what a terrific save in close. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you got to find a way to put the puck in the net. He covers and holds on. Just over eight minutes remaining in the period. A hockey game is one of lead changes, and this one has seen its lead vanish. On to a left. Oh, broke it up! Hangs on to that one, and he'll see a face-off right near him. The Condors have been hoping for a streak like this from him for some time, but how could they imagine it would go on for this long? Another excellent night adding to this lengthy point-scoring streak. The Knights with a face-off win. Directing that one to Cogliano. Moved along and in. Great stick work prevents the pass from being complete. Muscled long to Beauchemin. Points it. Chip to Beauchemin. Goes back deep for it. This game has been tightly contested the entire way. I can't see either team stretching this out at this point. Oh, he got that! Puck covered, whistle blown. The draw, the tie up, and his team prevails. Gets that one on a cross. Great opportunity denied. Can't get a shot on. Gathered in by Gardner. Laid on to Pyarvi. Gets across, looks over his options. Gets it in a good place. He's got that point pass. Got his glove on it. Takes that pass from the other point. Waits with it. Got that the trapper. That slight hesitation by the shooter allowed the goaltender to make a beautiful glove save.
Last minute to go in the third. Slid to Huberdeau. Propelled to Kuznetsov. That's the end. Good work by Palmieri. To Kuznetsov. Blocked away. He's pinned and held at the boards. Fires. Terrific save. Terrific opportunity. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. They won it. Now what can they do? Sends to the point. Solid rub out. No out of bounds in this sport. There was a pretty good boom when they went into the boards. That is a solid hit. Right into the slot. slot and a puck's on the backhand, you got to react quickly. Really good positioning. He's in the butterfly where he's got most of the net covered, but there's obviously a hole in the pucks behind him. The Condors have broken the tie here in the third period. What will they do next? How will they start to play this game? Aggressive, passive. He's in on an onside play. Goalie to the bench, substitution made. Net empty. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. And the game is over. Well played. It was. On the scoreboard, this was a loss. In other areas, well, they have to feel decent. Well, you can build off of the stats when it comes to winning faceoffs. They did that, but they did not result in a win. So as the tournament rolled on, energized play ended only by a final horn. Good night from all of us.